Hi everyone. So we're learning how to make a shopping bag today. And all we've been needing is our carry board, our bag lining, um, the bag handle, and of course your accessories. Then your gum, your tape, scissors, your rule, and that's all. So I've been able to get the measurement. And the measurement is 12 by 9, 12 by 9. Now it depends on how large you want yours to be. If you want yours to be more than this, it's up to you. If you want yours to be 15 by 10, it's up to you. And the size is, um, the length, the length is um, dependent on your measurements from here and here and here. Do we understand? It depends on you measure here here and here then the the, the breadth is um i'm using um four inches for it so the next thing you are going to do is to cut out your lining like this but what you are you should take note of is one one inch extra like this for gumming one one inch extra for gumming and you will do the same thing for your anchor fabric one one inch extra for lining like this please don't forget like this now and for for this one i have been able to gum it now i left one inch extra and i did the gumming everywhere so what i did was i measured the lined part that is this is nine i bent it after making the lining this is nine i bent it so that it will give me the shape i'm looking for this is 12 that's for this side i also bent it and this is nine as well now see how it came out this is an idea of it so when you are done you know you place your gum and, and gum it when you are done you will spread your gum all over here like this and you will still create you will place your anchor here and please don't forget the one inch that i told us about the one inch extra so if this is for what you are cutting is five everywhere here and here so i have done that so the next thing for us now is to start the gumming process so i will just do the one for the lining so that we will see so this is it the first thing you will do is you will spread your gum but when spreading your gum here you don't need to do it so much you just spread it little so that the lining will just have to stick but it's not that you just spread it as if you are spreading the uh, butter on bread you just do it shallowly like this now the next thing for you to do is to place it on your lining like this then where that the place that needs gum properly is the edge here you spread here and here like this like this this is it so this is the place that needs your gum so you start gumming it carefully just as I am doing it right here so that's how you will do on your anchor and on the sides so I'll just do that for us yeah. all right guys so I want to show us how to finish this this top so what you do is you apply your gum here like this you bend it one then apply another gum on your lining that's the lined part and you bend like this so that it will look neat this is it something like this so the next thing for us to do now is to start um bending it to our lining so like i told us i bent it already so that it's very easy like this so 
so all you need to do is you just apply gum all over and it just fall into place by itself so then the next thing for us to do is to apply you apply your gum everywhere here except for the top except for the top the rest places you need gum so this is it like this so the next thing for us to do now is to start gumming it so is the Ankara now that will aid you to just cover it up like this carefully So you just go on and on with it like this. So you just make sure it is on on the other lined part, and it's just be falling into place by itself. Then the next one will go like this. So the extra inch now, the extra Ankara inch is what will be the gumming aid to your lining. So it is very important for you to get an extra inch for it. So this is it. So I will just do that for the order. I'll place this one here and do the same thing like I did for this one and I'll get back to us. So guys, I have been able to I'll call this one later. I've been able to place the two lining and this is how it came out. So the next thing for us to do now is to apply our accessories. I'm just using just like sticks because um, the fabric is already cut off by itself. So I have done this. Now what you do in applying your accessory, you just bore a little hole. This is how it comes. You just pierce it inside the hole like this. Then it has two opening like this. So this is what you do, it has to open. You just make sure you place it very well with your with your finger because if you use your hammer on it, it might just go flat. So make sure you use your hand. Now the next thing for us to do is to place place the bag like this and like this on what we've done to get our shopping bag ready so what we are doing now is to spread our gum all over here and here here and here allow it to dry a little then we'll start placing it okay guys so i am done the next thing for us to do now, and I also allowed it to dry so the next thing for us to do is to place it carefully now on each other. So this is it.
so if it doesn't come out the way it should you will still open it like mine didn't come out so i will still open it and i'll have to do it carefully so that they will all align to have <clears throat> a very neat work and a neat finishing okay so i think i am done with this one So, this is our bag. Now, the next thing for us to do. So, for the um, accessories, you can use as much as you want. It's just your choice and how shiny you want it to be. But I think this one is okay for me. Now, the next thing for us to do now is to use our bag handle like this this is it so this is what you do with your back handle the this one here that has space will be inside while this one will be outside same goes with this one so what you do is you just get the middle and then it's either you hammer it or you just press it by yourself and it just goes right inside. Please, when you are putting it, make sure your measurement is accurate so that it's not have to look rough. So this is it. You use your hammer and hammer it inside like this so that it will come out accurately. Just giving us an idea. Who oh, I don't know how am I in? So this is it, and our shopping shopping bag is all set and ready to go. So guys, thank you for watching, and see you in my next class. Bye.